guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 6 of Tribe 9. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1. Hold on. 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, let's see what happened with my babies today. BTW, I am sorry that this is late. When I came home on Monday after the hell of Valentine's Day, working at UPS, ah! Oh, Dude, he might even die by the end of this episode. I mean, he is literally like, yes, I am challenging y'all. Y'all literally messed up last week. So you know what? Mm. Oh! Yeah, but it might be too late. Maybe we should just let them handle this on their own. They'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, because pandemic-ish? Yes, sir. Sir, I know that you and Rindo from Neo The World Ends With You... Exactly. You say that. But the next thing you know, you're going to lose. 
You might die. We don't need someone else dying again. <sighs> Fine. No, I, I think he's gonna hit it this time. Oh. Uh, don't underestimate him. Oh, God. You can't do anything by yourself, though! Unfortunately. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ.
damn it, Kadaka. Hell. <laughs> Are you sure? Please? Yeah. <sighs> That's right. That's <laughs> what I love about Haru. He's so positive. You're right about that, though. Exactly, that's what you get. <laughs> but you want to become better, right? <laughs> Did you really go by yourself, though?
<laughs> I mean, hey, but what if he doesn't have time for this, though? See? No. You're not serious enough. You know he's going to come back, though, right? <laughs> and here he comes. <laughs> of course there's a trick. They're cheating with it, of course. Come on now. Exactly! Exactly.
Good job, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you might as well. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what? Well, can we talk about how I how fast this episode went. I mean, okay. One, rest in peace to try from last week. I, I was really thinking that, you know, up against, you know, my other husband, oh, they would have been okay. But no, when he plays, he plays the kill, no matter what. Like, damn. Like, that's now two people he's killed! <laughs> I, I cannot... It is too much. But, like, with Tyga, like, I love that he, even since episode one, he's very passionate. Yes, he's not the best player, but just like Haru, he tries the best that he he can. Both of them really try. Like, Haru's just really good at, like, the hand-eye coordination. Tyga, it depends, but this episode, he really, truly proved himself it's about getting out of your head and such, which he has done for several freaking episodes. And I'm happy that finally he did a hit on his own and not fuck it up. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Just good job, baby. Yay! It's hot in here. I wish the air was on. <laughs> but yeah, this is a good episode. But like, god dang, it went by really fast. This week, I, I mean, I'm like, hold up, we already done. <laughs> like Jesus Christ. I mean, once Kazu came in and told um Taiga that he had to go see, you know, Hana Sakura and such, and you know, basically Taiga saying not taking no for an answer, it just was like, boom, 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 bam, we're done this week. But yeah, this was a really interesting episode. I hate the fact that, you know, once again, Kadaka's just like, yeah, we're killing characters and I don't give a fuck. Like, I I'm still, once again, hoping that, you know, when this game does eventually come out between, by the time the anime ends, sometime next month, um, to the end of the year, that we do get a lot of backstory on a lot of these characters. Because, I mean, Kadaka's really good at doing that with his characters, but because of the fact is, it's a quote-unquote mobile game, I just wonder how much he's gonna put into it. Because of the fact is, he, he is busy with this, he's busy with that one collab that he's doing with Spike Junsoft, which that teaser came out, like, I think at the beginning of the year. Um, so he's in a lot of things, plus, like, anything else that we don't really know about truly as of now. So it's just like, okay... Spending your time wisely on something like this. And this is why I think a lot of us who are really big fans of his were hella pissed about this becoming a mobile game because a lot of us really truly wanted to see it like on the big screen, PlayStation, Switch, whatever, so that we could play it at home. Like, I, I love me some mobile games just as much as anyone else, but I was a little turned off on it as well. So, I mean, yeah, here's hoping because there is there was a point where it was like, um, it still says mobile, but then, like, for other things, it's still to be determined, so probably we'll know something about that soon. Like I said, preferably when this anime series is done, and probably when they have the Webtoon series come out as well. But, yeah, I really just hope and pray that we get a lot more information and things established for these characters, because... I, I feel like I know them, but I don't know them to that certain extent. If you compare, like... The Danganronpa characters to the Akadama Drive characters to these characters, the Danganronpa and Akadama Drive characters, I feel like I know so fucking much about. But these core characters of this show, it's like half and half as of right now. But I still enjoy it. 
I just need a little bit more on each and every one of these characters. So hopefully we get that soon. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode six of Tribe Nine. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode seven. Once again, I am so sorry. This is a couple of days late. Like I said, when I came home on Valentine's Day after working, I took a nap and I fell asleep and by the time I woke up I was I was a little bit energized but I was still sleepy so I was like I need to do this on a different day but yes until then I will see you guys all next time bye